Good afternoon, I hope you've had a lovely day so far. Um, but yeah, my day's been quite boring and that is why I haven't filmed so far because, um, well, one, I missed the bus. Well, I didn't miss the bus, I nearly missed the bus. He had to sit and wait for me. Luckily, I have a really nice bus driver who always waits for me if he can see me on the road walking to the bus stop. So yeah. Um, then two, I've spent all day in school and my brain is really hurting right now. I've got a massive headache and I want to go to sleep, that's why I look so tired. And yeah. And three, it's raining and I got really wet so my hair is like stuck to my head. So it's just drying off right now, that's why it looks really greasy, but it's not it's grease it's not greasy, it's just wet. So yeah. Um what else? Does anyone else find that like females especially but males if you have long hair that these bits dry before your roots because I don't understand that surely it should dry from the top and then the water should run down your head with gravity not like this bit then that bit I don't I don't get it but yeah apparently it works that way if you knew how can you please tell me because I don't know how I don't get that yeah so I finished Tuesday's work. I've still got that piece of work from Monday to finish. I'm halfway through that now though. Um so I'll probably do that tomorrow afternoon. And I now have some work to finish from today. Because don't you just hate it when teachers set you work for the next day? Like she set it under an hour ago and she wants it in first thing in the morning. Don't don't you just hate that? It's like do I not have a life? Or are you just trying to take my life away from me? Because I think that they think that both of them apply right now. But yeah. So, if you're a teacher, don't set work for the next day. Biggest piece of advice right there. Do not set work for the next day. It really stresses me out. It stresses me out because it's unnecessary stress. Because it's not urgent. And it can be done by the end of the week. And I actually could do it by the end of the week. It's not one of those coursework things where the deadline actually matters. I understand it has to be done by the end of the year, but I don't don't need it in for the following day. That's not necessary. But that's enough of my rant. If you agree, then or if you disagree, start a debate in the comments because I'd like to hear another side to this because I don't really see one right now. And I'd really like to see one. And last night, I actually did get to read um, the second chapter of Girl Online, the first book. And it's going so well so far. She's such a good writer, honestly. It's an amazing writer. But I'm only two chapters in. Two chapters and two blogs in. And it's, it's so far so good. I feel like I've been talking to the camera for ages, but I've actually not. So. Let's just pause for a moment. And breathe. In. And out. <laughs> but now. <laughs> um, I just, I keep looking this way because... If you can't, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but it's really, really raining. I mention the rain a lot in these videos, <laughs> but it's really, really raining. I want to see if you can see. Wait, I don't know if you can. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to watch that back and see if you can see it. But it's really raining and I don't like it. Because I was going to film on the way home, but. Apparently not. The sky decided otherwise. So, I need to go get some crisp because I don't feel very well. And crisp make me feel better. So, I'm going to get some crisp, I'm going to do my work, and then I'm going to vlog again later. So, I will see you then. Hello again, so it is now 25 to 9. 
and I've only been awake for 35 minutes. So, yeah, because as soon as I finish that vlog, I watch these standers just to wind down before I did all my work again. And then I went to put another program on so that I could do my work like with that program in the background and I fell asleep. <laughs> so I was asleep for like three hours from like about half four, five o'clock to about eight o'clock. So yeah. And now I need to do my work. I've got double jointed hands in case you were wondering because my hands always go funny shapes and everyone's like, oh, how did you do that? It's double jointed. I can't stop it. I can't feel it. I can't stop it. So, yeah, just kind of have to bear with that. Um, but yeah, I need to now do my work and I also need to go in the bath because I haven't been in for about three days and that's disgusting. But you know when you just start back at school and you just forget about everything else? Because I don't know why actually. Why do you forget about everything else? Maybe because it's school and it tires you out. It tires me out. Don't know about anyone else. If anyone else falls asleep, let me know because right now I think I'm the only person on the planet that falls asleep at my age after school. So yeah. I think that's it really because obviously I've not done anything so I haven't got anything to talk about. I keep looking down here because my dogs are laid on my bed. <laughs> There's like no room for me because they've taken over. So hopefully they'll get off later when I open the door and go out because that's what they usually do. So I'm going to do my work, I'm going to have a shower and then I shall be back. Hopefully. So, I'll see you then. OMG, guys, my makeup stayed on in the bath. So, I need to go wash it off in a minute. But, yeah, my hair's really nice and soft now. I just keep sitting, like, stroking it. It's really relaxing. I don't know if you can hear in the background, but I'm printing all that stuff out for that homework that I had to do. And it's really doing my head in because it's not printing right at all. What's my hair doing? I hate it when I've had a shower because it just does this. Frizzy. Until I brush it. And to be honest, I can't be bothered. Because it's night and it's going to get frizzy overnight anyway. So, I'll just do it in the morning. But yeah, the print is really annoying me. Because it keeps printing random pages and then missing random pages. And it's like, what are you doing? Because I need you to work. So yeah, it's not going great. <laughs> it's literally like I had to stick all the pieces. Oh god, it's going dodgy again. I can, you know, when you can hear it going dodgy. Yep, it's gone again. But um, yeah. I forgot what I was gonna say. I have the shortest memory ever. I have a really good long-term memory. Ask me what I had for tea, no idea. So yeah, <laughs> I need a new memory. I need to be reminded to get one of those because I'll probably forget. <laughs> but yeah, um, what was I actually? I know I was talking about a printer, that's about it. Yeah, so I have random pages just sticking out everywhere. Because I've put the ones in that actually printed right, and then I'm trying to like save the pages. I don't really want to put the pages in that I haven't printed properly because then I'll probably f forget to print. I'm making myself sound self a little bit. I'm making myself sound really good here. I oh, know. I just forget everything. <laughs> so yeah, but I don't. Um, so I'll probably forget to reprint those if they're like not sticking out my folder like if they're in my folder I forget to reprint them so I've just got like these pages I don't know if you I don't know if I should show you my bed right now it's a bit of a stationary mess but yeah it's a bit of a stationary mess guys 
This is what school does to you. And I hate it. I'm so glad I'm getting on holiday next week. Does anyone know how to say hello in French? Because if you do, can you please tell me? Because I was having a conversation with my granddad the other day and I could remember, if I actually know how to say it, I just can't remember it. Like, I've got a massive mental block of how to say stuff in French. But yeah, teach me French, please. Over the next week, guys, that's your job. Teach me French. But yeah. So I was having a conversation with my granddad basically saying, like, hello in different languages. And I was like, what actually is the French word saying hello? I think it's bonjour, but I'm not sure. I really need to get learning this. Or I'm going to struggle next week. <laughs> but yeah, I was like, I know the Italian way, I know the Spanish way, I know the Chinese way. I know a lot of ways. I know the Japanese way. It's like... How can I know the Japanese way and not the French way when my country and the French country have like this much water on the map between us compared to like say somewhere like America there's like this much water on the map. I understand that that's a lot of water. I'm not just like I only have to step over the puddle or something. I, I don't actually think that. It's like I know that that on a map is like extremely wide in real life. I'm not that stupid. Or maybe I am. No, I'm not. I'm not. I really need to go sort this printer out. So, yeah. I think that's me done for today. I've had enough. I'm exhausted. My eyes are black. I don't like it. I need more sleep. But how am I expected to, honestly, right, think about it this way. How am I expected to sleep when they give me so much homework? They want me to sleep, they want me to eat properly, and they want me to do homework. Well, take your pick because either one, two, or three, not gonna happen otherwise, is it? So. My hair's annoying me now, I think I need to go brush it. You know when it's like slightly damp, but slightly dry? I can't decide whether it's wet or not. I know this bit's like damp, but this bit feels like slightly damp. I don't know if it's just because it's cold or what. But yeah. So I'm going to finish here for today, guys. And... I think... We should all go bombard our teachers. Honestly, though, if they don't mark your work, don't do it. Because... They always have other students' work to mark them. So <clears throat> I'm sorry, my voice just went all weird. Yeah, they always have other students' work to mark, but we always have other people's homework to do. Other teachers' homework to do. So, just don't do it. I wouldn't, anyway. Not on time. I'd do it, but for my benefit, not for theirs. So, I wouldn't stress over it. So that's my advice for today, life advice. So I'm going to finish there and I will see you tomorrow. Have a nice evening. Peace out.